Hello children, how are you today? So I'm your teacher Tasha here. We'll be looking at science GLP year 4. So today we're gonna see one guide to answer science paper 2 questions. This is a simple guide, um, just like intro for year 4 students. Uh, because maybe uh, you might not have any encounters or any exposure to this kind of question just a simple guide only hopefully it benefits you okay let's continue so we'll be looking at two questions this is one of the question so from this question you know they're gonna ask about observations uh, orders variables patterns conclusion everything so let's start so you can look at the question eh? so you have always eh? always have to read the instruction above always read this instruction don't ever skip these instructions very important so now we can look so uh diagram one shows the rate of breathing of four people i mean ali achong and ravi in a minute so we have rate of breathing per minute pupils I mean, Ali, Achong, and Ravi. I mean, uh, breath, uh, breathing rating is 70. Ali is 90. Achong is 80. And Ravi is 60. So, you already get your information. So, from this one, you have to get variable. So, this one, the pupil are manipulative variable. And the above one, rate of breathing per minute is responding variable. So let's continue. State two observation based on the bar chart shown in the diagram. So two observation, you can say that Ali have the highest rate of breathing. Uh, Achong has the second highest rate of breathing. Uh, Ravi has the lowest. Well, I mean the second lowest. So how you do is you um, tell what you saw in the data. Okay. So to put uh, Ali's rate of breathing per minute is the highest. Ravi's rate of breathing per minute is the lowest. Okay, so they ask for observation. Observation means what you observe. Next one, uh, arrange the pupil according to descending order, beginning with the highest rate. Okay, to breathing to the lowest. So it will be highest means Ali, yeah? Ali, Achong, Amin, and Ravi. Okay. Let's continue. Okay, what is being measured in this investigation? So, they are asking about responding variable. So, we already look what is responding variable, which is rate of breathing per minute. What is the changes pattern in of the breathing? So, they are they are asking for the changes in the, uh, uh, the graph. So, you can see it's increasing and then it's decreasing. So, your answer will be increase and decreases okay so the next one is conclusion that can be made for this experiment so conclusion is something that you talk about hypothesis some of you can write the hypothesis back some of it you can have to make it generally it's like a general conclusion that you get from the investigation so everyone has a different rate of reading Next one, what activity causes a high rate of breathing? So it will be reading, running, sleeping. Obviously, it will be running. Okay. So these are the type of normal questions we get in paper two. So just I teach you, just choose a simple one, just to discuss the answer with you all. So you can see here I uh, have three small. Um, you always have to read the instruction. Diagram 2 shows an investigation carried by Priya. She places three tail, small towels of different sizes in three containers with some same volume of water, which is 60 ml. So this is the containers, and the, and you can see after 20-15 minutes, she has recorded the data. Eh? Recorded the volume of remainder water in the containers. Okay, so first you have to find for your manipulated variable, which is sizes. So the towel size are different. Eh? And then the responding variable is the volume of the remainder water. Okay, for the aim, you have to put in your manipulated variable and responding variable. 
to investigate the relationship between the size of the towel and the volume of the remainder water. Okay, so whenever you want to write your aima, you always have to remember the color in the the words in the blue color will be the same. Okay, the 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 words that teacher highlighting now it will be the same for every aim. Only the manipulative variable and responding variable will be the different one. Okay, so state the two constant variables in this experiment. Which one didn't change at all? Size of the container and also the initial volume of water. Uh, because the size of the container are the same and the initial volume of water, every container receives the same amount of 60, 600 ml of water. Okay, which of the pattern of the volume? What is the pattern? It's decreasing and eh? it doesn't increase. So, decreasing. So, you can ask me, Disha, where you find? You can see it's decreasing 500 to 350 to 200. So, let's keep on decreasing. Next one. Study the relationship between the size of the towel. Okay, you already given you see size of the towel and the volume of water absorbed by the towel. So we have to state the relationship between the size of the towel and also volume of the water. Okay, so we have to put in all this size of the towel and also volume of the water here. So the answer if the relationship with the size of the towel increases, the volume of the water absorbed by the water towel also increases. This is a common sense, right? Next one is the predict the volume of the remainder water. The towel use is smaller than the size of the container. So the volume of the remainder water will be more than the 50 ml. 500 ml. Because uh, the size of the towel is uh, smaller than the towel in container are. So it will be less more than 500 ml. Okay, so what is the conclusion based on this experiment? So when the volume of the water decreases, uh, sorry, the volume of the water decreases when the size of the water tower is increases. So you can um, also write as as the size of the tower increases, the volume of the water, remainder water also decreases. So that's all, students. It's a very simple thing to do we have to take a lot of uh, have to do a lot of exercise uh, a lot of revisions just to identify what the question is asking so that's all for today thank you students don't forget to like share and subscribe